270 arrives in land view and perfect. All right. The next time I book a flight, there's Stace. It's gonna be first class. First class all the way. Confirmation number and done. All right. Don't you worry. I will be back soon to get the wheels a turning. And when we're done, I'll get the money. Rex will get the girl, and you'll get Rex just like you always wanted. What am I doing? I'm gonna miss my flight. Oh, wait. I just thought of something. We're gonna have to come up with a new location. For what? Your sister's engagement party. We can't have it at the mansion now that you're not living there anymore. Oh, no. Uh, Shane and I, we're gonna be sticking around. Uh, you know it doesn't count if you give up the cash, but you keep the real estate, right? I won't own it. I will just be living there. Clint asked Shane and I to stay. Was he medicated at the time? Well, it's no skin off his nose. He can't use it, and he wants to keep it in the family. And you and Shane are family now? Clint's words, not mine. Okay, great. So the party's back on. Which is great, because we never would have found anywhere as perfect as the mansion that place was made for Halloween night. Wait, the engagement party is on Halloween? Yeah, why not? Nothing livens things up like costumes. Better start thinking about what you want to be. Well, how about Rex Balsam? How about no? No one gets in without a disguise. Natalie will be cool with that, right? She doesn't seem like the super traditional type. No, she's not. Really. Come on, everybody loves Halloween. The one night of year when we all get to dress up in something crazy and leave our real selves behind. Isn't that everyone's fantasy? Doesn't everyone secretly want to try to be someone they're not? You look awful. I've been spending a lot of time with my dead mother. <laughs> kind of ruins my sleep patterns. Well, you'd see less of me if you'd stop carrying around that suitcase full of guilt. I have nothing to feel guilty about. Except shooting your mother. You shot me first. Fine. But Victor didn't. He was unarmed, helpless. And you fired anyway. No, you made me do that. You got in my head. Uh, yeah, of course. And broke you out of jail and put the gun in your hand and walked you over to Victor's house and pulled the trigger. I'm sure that's how the police will see it. Look, you did what you had to do. Stop making excuses and for shifting blame. Admit what you did. Own it. I didn't really have a choice, did I? Victor was going to come after me first chance he got. Atta boy. Now you're talking. You were justified. And whatever you do, don't listen to Blair. If Tomas Delgado wants to act the martyr, let him. He will have his nobility, you will have your family, and everybody will live happily ever after. Everybody but Tam, Blair. Thank you for your honesty, Mr. Delgado. All of us have made decisions that we regret, and you are no exception. But this is not a simple matter. The woman you shot was not just a victim. The Commonwealth has stipulated to the crime she committed Irene Manning was a proven danger to this community. Some might say you did us all a favor. But we do not take the law into our own hands in this country. We have a justice system in place, and it is my duty to make sure that system does not condone murder. So, it is therefore the decision of this court to sentence you to Statesville Prison for a term of 20 years. Just saying. Is that the personal man? I really like you. Mm. And the kid. Oh, total angel. But the road is no place for either one of them. You can go now, Rick. I am just telling you like it is. You have a tough job ahead of you. Recordings, performances, talk shows. There are only so many hours in the day. You don't want to spend them feeling guilty, do you? She said you can go. No, go. James, wait, 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 wait. Hey, please. Can you take Hope upstairs for me while I talk to Rick? Oh, what's there to talk about, Sora? Don't worry about it. I can take care of it. It won't take long. Please, thank okay. you. Honey, good with James. Yeah. Take this. You know how to use it. Point and spray. 
She's beautiful, by the way. What's that, mace? It's pepper spray, and I'm not afraid to use it. Might not be a bad idea. Seriously, you give me a little spritz, I play hurt, I leave Where the Where do you get off throws. telling me how to live my life? We need to work on your image, your brand. That's what makes news. We can't do that by dragging around your nice guy boyfriend and an adorable toddler. Sorry, Rick, but they're part of the brand. But it doesn't have to be. Look at Brittany. Do you see pictures of her kids anymore? Hell no. Somebody got some brains and said, no moss. And now she is back to being sexy, nasty, relevant, Rick. and rich. I'm not Brittany. I'm not her. It's not what I want. Sweetheart, it doesn't matter what you want. You don't have a choice.